Hi art friends. Hey art friends. I hope you're thirsty because I've got a lot of Kool-Aid. Ooh. Look at all this. We have got eight. What I'm thinking is we do four today and we do four again next time. So if you want to see us paint with Kool-Aid again, like the video, let us know. Because I'm really curious to see if this works and we will paint with it again. Oh, can I do a blind pick of which colours we get this time? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, you yeah. have to pick the four, so... Oh, all four? <laughs> Don't yeah. you want to pick any? Yeah. So if they're terrible, it's all on you! <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Just so you know as well, these aren't really a thing in the UK. Yes, that's true. That's I why once... it's taken us so long to get them. <laughs> yeah. You gonna pick one? Oh yeah, I'll close my eyes. I <laughs> this is not going to work. Give me the camera okay. and we shall do it this way. Am I close? You know what? Get away! <laughs> I'm setting them up. I'm going to set them on the bed so don't do anything just to get those away! <laughs> and I'm actually going to take this opportunity to mix them up again. <laughs> and I need to pick four. You need to pick four. Now they're in two rows in front of you. They're in two rows of four. So just get a feel for them first, just so you know where they are. Oh, okay. You see You see what I I'm doing? I want that one. Okay. I want that one. Okay. I want that one. Okay. Oh my, oh my god! I want that one. Okay, I'm gonna move got. these away, and you gotta tell me what flavors we're oh, working with. We got grape, which is like my favorite flavor ever. We've also got cherry, that's one of Adam's favorite. Yeah, flavors. I like that one. Oh! We have also got pink lemonade. Oh, oh my god. It's making me so emotional. <laughs> oh no! And also tropical punch. Oh, we've actually got quite a nice color range. Yeah, it's uh, very reddies and purpley, sort of like berry colors, and then we've got a bit of blue. Hmm. But I'm not sure if Tropical Punch would be blue. I guess we'll find out. It's all of the magic of Kool-Aid. The picture of the drink's red. Oh, wait. The Kool-Aid man's red. Ah, what if they're all red? <laughs> That's like, plot twist, we're all red. Now, these are the four that we're not using. If you want to see us use these next time, give us a thumbs up, guys, and we shall do this again. Oh, that's quite a groovy colour palette. It's yeah. like a highlighter colour palette. I really like this one, so <laughs> I kind of want to do this too. Let's put these over here, though. We're not using these today. What I'm thinking is we're gonna get like a little, you know, like those things from ink, so they're called pipettes. We're gonna get one of those, fill it with water, oh, okay. and then mix it with just a tiny bit of that powder, because we're not gonna need all of it. Oh, I thought you meant you wanted to use the pipette to suck up the powder. <laughs> That's not gonna work. That's not what pipettes are for. <laughs> it's time for a science lesson. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, you know the drill. We oh, God, I've really hit that. <laughs> I'm sorry. We're going to be using Canson watercolour paper. I've also got these over here. These were the uh, grape juice, the Welch's ones, which we were very underwhelmed with. So let's see if this grape juice will be more powerful. Oh, that's actually a really, yeah. Grape juice. Oh, I'm glad you've picked that. So we can kind of make a direct comparison. That's awesome. Yeah, let's see if artificial grape juice is better. <laughs> let's see if chemicals can improve this. <laughs> Welcome to painting with Kool-Aid. <laughs> I have some interesting developments. Do you? Okay. I've got a bit of water in this pipette to put into my little water dish. Put in here, okay. I've also torn the packet open. Okay, I can smell it. <laughs> I, was just I can about smell to say that. Whoa. The shocking revelation is that this smells really good. I can. S that is. Let me hold I can smell it from <laughs> over the. Yeah, let's have a. Let's have a... <coughs> should I put the powder in first? I should have put the water I'd in. I'd put first? the powder in first, but remember, don't put it all in because it's going to be like a paste. Yeah, that's good, that's good. That's good. Then just add a bit of water and uh, <laughs> just give it a stir, I guess. <laughs> Does it need more than that? It's definitely looking a lot darker than what yeah, the old grape juice did. Like a hundred percent darker. The good news is uh, we've oh managed my... to mix a black by the looks of it. But What is that? Why is it that dark? I like how with the first one we were like, why is it went more of a reddy pink? Yeah. It's oh, it, it smells, smells amazing. Delicious. But it's the colour of licorice and that it's kind of strange. I think you need more water in that. No, it'll dilute it down more. You reckon? I can put some in, but... I think it needs more. We apologise, but we're definitely noobs at Kool-Aid, because... Steph... We're noobs at Kool-Aid. <laughs> Steph's had it, like, once or twice. I've never actually had it. There we go. That's starting to look like a paint to me. That looks good. <laughs> and less like a syrup. Yeah. That looks good to me. Yeah. Okay. That brush has been through a lot. <laughs> I know, it really Grape has. juice, soy sauce... We'll link them in the cards, guys, if you're curious what that brush has been through. <laughs> and now Kool-Aid. What's the next flavour, hun? Cherry. Ooh, okay. Oh, I can already smell it. It's bringing back childhood memories. It's bringing back flashbacks. 
oh my god that reminds me of um some childhood sweets i have i think they were called like frosties and they were like cherry does anyone else in the uk know what i'm on about right? well everyone's gonna say the cereal no 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 not the cereal it was like hard candy oh i don't think i have i've heard of them but you're shoving that right in my yeah, <laughs> shoving it in his nose <laughs> that smells like cherry bakewells to me have you guys ever had a cherry bakewell before yeah, they're really yummy like cherry <laughs> hey <laughs> Oh no, that powder's more purple. Ooh. Oh yeah, there it goes. I like Ooh, how everyone wow. probably has Kool-Aid in their life. It's just like... We're yeah. amazed. By that is such a blood red. Whoa. Whoa, that's as red as the red ink video yeah. we did. We found something more pigmented than red ink. <laughs> that's kind of scary. Guys, and you put this inside yourself. <laughs> what is this stuff made out of? Let's try Tropical Punch. Ooh. Guys, what colour do you think Tropical Punch will be? Well, I hope it's blue. Oh, that smells interesting. That smells tropical. <laughs> That's so weird. It smells like pineapples. Like old pineapples. <laughs> Let's see what we're working with here. What colour is this? The powder always seems to come out the same colour, but then it changes colour when you add the water by the looks of it. That alarms me. Whoa. Oh, I think it's going to be about the same colour as the cherry. Whoa. Underwhelming. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say that to cherry. Oh yeah, wow. Oh. Oh, actually maybe it's a bit more of an orangey. It's more orangey. It's more of like a Lisa Simpson red. <laughs> Lisa Simpson dress orange. Yeah, that's how I always <laughs> describe that colour. A new colour discovered by Stephanie Evans. <laughs> Does anyone else refer to it? Is that, <laughs> Is that the poll? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Do you refer to this very specific type of orange as Lisa Simpson dress orange? This is going to be the most one-sided poll ever. Oh, what's this one? What's this? Pink lemonade. Oh, this is the last one for so, today. Do you think it'll be pink? I really hope so. Ooh. Oh, it's light. This one's quite lightly coloured. Let's see. It's almost blending in with the palette there. Oh, oh, Ooh. oh. There's quite a nice tone difference in those three. Yeah, at least they're cool. slightly different coloured. I'm feeling confident about this one. I think this might work. And <laughs> if, might. We, if we feel like they're too washed out, we can add more powder. Yeah, that's true. If you want it to be more syrupy to ruin my brush. Do you have any idea what you want to draw now we have our mediums in front of us? Originally, I had an idea of something that I wanted to draw. Mm -hmm. But now all these smells, this room, it smells so tutti fruity. <laughs> I might draw something a bit more fruity than I was expecting. Oh, okay. Maybe like a fruit bowl or something really exciting. A fruit. Ooh. Oh, look what I've managed to do already. What are you done? My hand's covered in all kinds of mysterious Kool-Aid powder colours. My hand's covered in mysterious liquids. <laughs> yeah, but I didn't realise. And I've touched the watercolour paper and now there's like a big Kool-Aid smudge. So we're quickly getting up a sketch so that we can try and colour it I with this. I paint with these things. I'm going to give her like big berry hair. Oh, that's like, really cool. Yeah. So I got big hopes on this big Kool-Aid. I've tried to pick... Mostly things that I can colour in with like reds and purples. Yeah. I've drawn a little compilation of some happy fruits. <laughs> oh, well, that's really cute. I'm going for like an 80s gym look with mine. Oh, that's really cool. Like a le like those uh, leotard things. I'm going for one of those. Are you going to draw any fruit on her leotard? Uh, yeah, maybe. That'd be pretty cool. Or you could draw a watermelon slice. A watermelon, a huge watermelon slice. Adam likes watermelon. Watermelon's pretty cool, right? The guinea pigs like it as well. Yeah, they really love it, yeah. You know, I've got high hopes for this one. Oh, wow. Compared okay. to the grape juice one, which, as we said, these yeah. are the results of the grape we juice. We got them to compare. But the fact that I managed to smudge this colour onto the paper, that's already a much more interesting colour than this. So. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> I think we're onto something. Okay, are we ready? This is the moment of truth. Yeah. Which colour are you going to pick? Oh, you said the moment of truth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> that's totally from you. <laughs> I want to find out if this is going to be a purple colour. Is that the grape one? Yeah. Okay. This one's grape. And this is meant to be a little blueberry over here, so let's see. Oh, whoa. That's definitely not purple. <laughs> what colour is that? I don't even... It, to be honest, it's just like an ink wash. It's like it's a, a really dark grey kind of colour. <laughs> I guess you could use like a white gel pen to get his, <laughs> to get his, his, his little eyes back. back. Yeah. I'll probably ink over it. Hey, it works though. It definitely works. Yeah, it can be stylistic. It's definitely working better than what uh, 
The Welch's grape juice. Thing. Yeah, that Welch's. You're terrible. No. I'm impressed already. <laughs> I'm already having a disaster. Oh, and it's already stained the paper. <laughs> so, wow, so it stained it already too. Yeah, even though it hasn't even been on for that Welch's long. Welch's was way more forgiving. Was this one cherry? Yes. Yeah, this yeah. one's cherry. I'm going to colour my cherry in with cherry. Logical choice. That's looking good. Oh, that, wow! It literally is like our red ink video. Because yeah. <laughs> I've got the grey ink wash that I use. Kool-Aid's way cheaper than red ink. <laughs> yeah, guys, if you're on a budget and you've got some Kool-Aid around the house... <laughs> Subscribe for more art tech. This one's pink lemonade, but I didn't want to draw a pink lemon, so I've got a raspberry over here. Oh, okay. Ooh! It oh, is that a one's colour. really Yeah. That is, that is a really nice pink. That's one of my favourite colours. I love pink lemonade. That is beautiful. I like that a lot. I wish I could get a shirt that says I love pink lemonade on it. We could make one and put it on Redbubble, maybe. <laughs> and then buy one for ourselves. <laughs> oh, for me. Oh, my brush smells so good. <laughs> that went so close to being up your nose then. <laughs> oh, it smells like show, but... Can I have a go? <laughs> oh, I thought you wanted to say <laughs> No! It. Oh, yeah, it does. Yeah, whoa. It smells so good. <laughs> Mixed it up good. Oh, oh yes. Pink <laughs> berries for the hair, I believe. Do you like it? I'm so chuffed that the pink did come out as a pink because I was like, oh yeah, pink berries could look really cute. They're almost like little bubblegum bubbles. Oh, <laughs> that's way cuter. I might just say they're bubblegum. <laughs> but they smell like pink lemonade. Oh, pink lemonade bubblegum, yes. Does that exist? If it doesn't, it needs to. That's amazing. <laughs> I wish these flavours were more prominent in the UK. Oh, we got nothing here. <laughs> nothing at all. Like, anyone in the comments down below, is there any kind of, like, food or drink or flavour that the UK has that you guys don't that you wish you had? Because I oh, never hear wow. of that. That you wish you had. Because we could tell you a million and twelve things that we wish that we had. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> One million and twelve. <laughs> the last twelve will make a list. <laughs> You're getting some nice gradients on these. Oh, aren't I clever? I'm not sure if it's intentional or... <laughs> what do you mean? I don't know if it's intentional. <laughs> I don't know if he's really good or he's just an idiot. <laughs> I'd pat you on the hand, but I know you get really cranky about that. Don't pat my bro. <laughs> Big news. Adam is going into uncharted colour territory. Into the tropical punch. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. <laughs> I love how Tropical Punch gets its own theme song. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. Oh, it is Lisa Simpson coloured. The poll is void. It is Lisa Simpson coloured. <laughs> yeah, and if you voted anything else, you're wrong. <laughs> this one really is acting just like a watercolour like paint. It's so strange. Yeah, I think I've actually used watercolours that are not as pigmented as Kool-Aid. It's actually just like... I am blown away, guys. Guys, you people in America and places like that, you are sitting on like a gold mine of watercolour replacements. <laughs> I am impressed. Makes you wonder what colour, like, it turns your insides. <laughs> oh, I bet it's a tropical punch in there. <laughs> Which one? The, the grape one was the darkest one, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, okay. I, I bet you can tell which one that one is. Is it this one? Yeah. <laughs> the one that seems to be slowly shrinking into its own void. Yeah, I don't know what it's doing. It's like a black <laughs> hole. It's not purple in the slightest, is it? <laughs> oh, is it still, like, in date? Is, is it, like, expired? Yeah, I looked on the back of the packets and it said that they're good until about February. Ooh. Which, to be honest, I thought powder would last longer than only, like, a couple of months. But... That's, that's just when the magic of Kool-Aid wears away. <laughs> The colour palette of this one reminds me of really old comics. Can you remember when they used to be printed in, like, red and black? Oh, yeah, whoa. <laughs> Showing our age. Well, we weren't alive when they were printed in those <laughs> colours. Well, you were technically dead. That's how old it was. Oh, <laughs> oh I feel like my head almost fell off then. <laughs> <laughs> Has your mind been blown that way? Can they be blown your head off? <laughs> I just, like, cricked my neck or something and my head felt like it was going to fall off from the rest of my body. <laughs> oh, my God. Now, this is the pink, right? I'm like, I'm, I'm concerned my head's going to fall off and Adam's like, hmm, it's clear. which one of these colours is the pink? You're getting blood everywhere. Where's my pink? <laughs> is that the pink one? Is that yeah, the pink? I think so. Don't worry, it's not just you. They are actually really similar tones like, this time, right? 
You could always do a smell test if you want to find out which one's which. Oh. Oh, can I smell them? Can you smell them? Yeah. Can you film me smelling them? <laughs> we interrupt this too late to bring you smelling with Steph. Uh oh, it happened. What have you done? Guys, I, I appear to have... <laughs> done that thing you always do. <laughs> appear to have smudged my Kool-Aid. <laughs> I'm trying to avoid these strawberry seeds, but I think it's a lost cause because it's just like, nope. So I've got a question. Oh no, what now? <laughs> you know when we finish painting? Yeah. Are you gonna drink that out the paint palette? Oh no! <laughs> Do you know guys, you don't know this guy's off camera. When we finished the when we finished the grape one, right? This sat on a windowsill for like two weeks and the grape <laughs> the grape juice went really funky and I am not drinking <laughs> out of that thing. <laughs> so no, you can drink out of it. <laughs> Leave a comment down below, guys, if you want Adam to drink it. I love, I love the silence. Leave a comment down below. <laughs> you're not denying it. Just leave a comment. Ooh, you're inking up now. Yeah, I'm just going over the lines quickly with this. The colour palette that this has all come together with the ink especially, I think it's working really well. Yeah, I would say that Kool-Aid is a success. I would say this one worked. I'd say Kool-Aid colour palettes are good. Woo! <laughs> what was that? Just a little woo. <laughs> Doesn't the cool lad man say, oh yeah? Oh, does he? Yeah. Can you give me your best, oh yeah? Oh yeah. <laughs> That's not oh. a cool lad man that bashes through a wall. He just sort of knocks politely <laughs> on your door and goes, oh yeah. <laughs> Here's our finished artwork for today then guys. Let us know what you think. Is Kool-Aid a win or do you think it failed? Let us know. I'm gonna link a mystery video over here. Maybe we'll link the Welch's one. Then you can compare it yourself. Don't forget to like the video if you haven't already and subscribe if you haven't already too. And we'll see you next time for another doodle date. Doodle date. <laughs> Bye guys.